Hey. Hey. Welcome back to Cage Land. So I'm actually getting ready to run out the door. Um, I wish I could see my outfit. I had like a sweater, a little see-through sweater. Some Aldo, I don't know, Babe bought these a couple years ago, some leggings. Anyway, I am on my way to meet with some other YouTubers and this is the first for me, y'all. Like I've never like hung out or got to meet other people who do what I do. So this is exciting. I'm gonna take you guys with me i'm pretty sure it's gonna be vlog on top of vlog on top of vlog so y'all get ready anyway i'm gonna get in the car and i'll talk to y'all in a minute bye y'all y'all gonna miss me they ain't gonna miss me okay guys finally out of the car <laughs> um i just need to figure out how to get out. oh thank you <laughs> thank you you think i'm checking myself and i'm really just vlogging All right, guys, I am here. Everybody's cool with me vlogging. I told y'all I didn't know if I was gonna be comfortable or not. So, um, <laughs> yes. this is the star here, y'all. I've been watching her for so long, and we email each other. And I'm like so obsessed with her. I know, yeah, we're here now again. I can't owe us one. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna try to introduce y'all to everybody. Hold on. Wait a minute. Now, why did you get cold again? She's stunting on us. When I eat, I put my glasses on. Okay, okay. <laughs> so, tell us, what's your channel? E. Michelle. E. Michelle. E. Michelle. I'll ask you. Don't want me to be great, but um, <laughs> I'm trying to find something to eat. Y'all, I'm so hungry. I literally haven't had anything all day. So, um, yeah. Sunday good morning so um, I just finished Shh. so I just did a spa at home facial that's why my skin looks so good it's so soft anyway I just did a full video on um, trying to get my skin back to healthy um, so look out for that that's gonna be coming up but hope you guys are having a great Sunday we have just been chilling honestly chilling I did recorded that video and the kids are eating a snack right now and then they're gonna take a quick little nap but I wanted to show y'all something I have been stashing some home decor stuff around the house I told y'all that and um, it's quite a bit so I want to show y'all what um, I've been picking up and where it's gonna go what I'm kind of thinking and stuff like that. 
<laughs> okay, so I'm starting with these things I got here. Now these came from Lindsay. Um, I don't know where she got them from, but she brought them to me and asked me if I like them. And I said, you know what? I may be able to use them on the stairs. Um, it's just a picture frame. It is two of them. One say live, love, laugh, and the other say family, love, memories. So I thought they were pretty cool. Um, so I just stashed them. And I found this um, picture frame. I thought the frame was just really pretty. Um, I don't like the picture that's in it, but that's totally fine. I can change it. Um, I don't know what kind of picture, maybe like a black and white picture of one of the kids when they were young or something. I don't know what I'm going to put in here yet, but um, I thought it was a nice frame, so I, I picked it up. Next thing is this blue tray I found at Home Goods. It has a few scratches on it, so it was definitely um, cheaper than it would normally be, but I found this and I thought it was so cute. I love the blue color and it just really helps me set that blue off in the house um, where I want to put this. So I'm going to show you guys in a minute, but I just thought this was super cute. Just a tray that I picked up at Home Goods. The next thing is this rug, and I have quite a few rugs too, y'all, so bear with me. I just wanna show y'all this. Okay, so I found this rug, and when I saw it, I just really couldn't pass it up. I didn't really know where I was gonna put it, but I'm kinda of thinking Jacob's room, um, once I get to his room to start decorating and stuff. And this is like the pattern of it. I just thought it was really pretty. Either I'm going to put it at the front door somewhere. I really don't want to put it at the front door because, you know, people walk in with their shoes and it's white. And I just know that that's going to get filthy really quick. And so I may just put this upstairs in the hallway or in Jacob's room. But this is the pattern. And I just thought it was so cute. And I picked this up at Target. It's originally $39, I mean $29.99. But... I got it for $8.98, so I felt like I was winning that day, y'all. <laughs> Next thing is, I end up running into this, um, let me take this stuff up, running into this, like, church yard sale, and I found these vases, and I just went nuts over them, y'all, honestly. I just thought they were so pretty, and it... It helps me tell the story that I'm trying to tell in this whole, you know, house with the blue, the white. So I picked up these and these were, I want to say these were uh, 50 cent a piece. But you see how it looks like it has like crystals in it, but it really doesn't. It's just a glass. I thought that was so pretty. And, um, you know, you could use these all year round, but Christmas is coming up. So... I kind of have an idea, but then I can use them on the bookshelves. So, yeah, I didn't want to pass those up. And if they would have had more, I would have gotten more too, but they didn't. That's all they had. So then, okay, let me move this one. I'll show you guys this one. Then I found these. And these look so antique and so old, but, y'all, I just I saw them and I was like, oh, I got to have those. Oh, they're so cute. It really looks like something my grandmother would have in her house, but... Um, I don't think, you know, they're that bad. I think they look very, like, luxury vases. Like, I haven't seen this at, like, Ross or Marshalls or anything like that. It doesn't fit my style, but I'm just going to try to make it fit. And if it doesn't fit, you know, I can always gift it. But, um, yeah, I thought they were really, really cute. I mean, they're kind of old school, but, yeah, and they're really heavy, like, really heavy. Okay, so at that same, like... Uh, sale like church sale that I went to I saw this vase here and I just have this piece of plastic wrapped around it I don't know why but this thing is so heavy um, it's just a beautiful vase I've saw one of these at I think Marshall's and it was $29.99 I think it was something like that like $29 for something like this and I paid a dollar for it so I just thought it was super cute um, you def I definitely could use this um, in the fall and in the spring, actually. So I, I could just see me putting hydrangeas in here and having it as a centerpiece on the table. Oh my goodness, that's going to be so beautiful. I am putting a bar, a mini bar together in the house. So I saw these. For I saw these like tulip glasses. I thought it was so cute. Um... Where did I find this? At Ross. I thought these were super cute at Ross. 
um, I'll take it out so you guys can see how different it is. It's not like I have a ton of glasses in our kitchen area, but that I have never seen this style with the flute like coming out like that. Like I've just never seen that. And it's small too because the mini bar that I'm building that I'm putting together, it's actually a small area. So these just fit. I think they're going to go perfect in that area. So I thought these were so cute, um, just the bottom part. And I'm thinking about like bedazzling the bottom part because it is so unique and it's going in, you know, a girly like mini bar. So there's four of these and yeah, I really, really like these. Like you can just see if you put like some kind of Swarovskis, you know, on the end of these, I just think it's going to be super cute. Okay, buddy, I'll charge it for you. This is um one of the rugs that I found. Um and I super love this rug, y'all. I, I just thought it was so cute. The little like gold speck. Wait a minute. Yeah, like the little gold, gold specks. Like, I just really like the pattern. Okay, guys, so I got rid of that stuff. And I want to show you guys this um, frame that I picked up. I found this. I don't know where I found this, y'all. Let me think about it. I think I got it from Home Goods or... Um, no! I found this in a thrift store. Yeah, I found this in a thrift store. Um, and when I seen it, I was like, oh, I got to have that. Look at the gold trimming on this. So this is a picture frame. Y'all know I'm going to change this out. But I just thought this was so beautiful. And I know exactly where I'm going to put it. I have the perfect place for this. Um, once I finish the whole decor thing. But I just thought this was so cute. All uh, the detailing in, in the um, frame. Like you just don't see frames like this. To me you know I think this is like one of those like old school ones. That I think is just super cute. I thought it was cute for the kitchen. Um, I picked it up for only $7, and I've been having this actually for a good little minute. But, yeah, I thought it was cute. Um, we need more rugs in the house, y'all, so you're going to see a whole bunch of rugs in these um, in this video. Um, I've been searching on overstock.com. I've been searching on rugs.com. But, honestly, all the great ones that I've been finding have been, like, in my local places, like local furniture places or um home decor places so yeah thing i got was these oh, y'all look look when i went in the store i kept trying to tell myself that these were ugly i was like no this is not it i, I just i could pick i could find something better but i could not put them down for some reason i just could not get rid of them i had to hold on to them and then finally when i looked at the detailing in it all the gold specs with the gold and cream fringe i was like girl you tripping those are bomb pick those up <laughs> so i got these um and i love these i don't know how i'm gonna accent it or set everything up but i'm excited to do all of this i got these from burlington for 5.99 and when i tell y'all like i these are legit worth like 20 bucks like they're really good quality and i mean just the look of them i can use these in the winter and the summer is what I was thinking. Like, ooh, that'd be so cute for the summer and the winter. So, yeah, these are cute if we can keep them clean. Y'all know how that goes. <laughs> All right, then the next thing I found was just this little shag rug to go in me and Babe's um, bathroom. Um... It's getting cold, like I said, so I'm picking up all these little rugs and stuff, even for the bathrooms, because, you know, as it get cold, hardwood gets cold, and um, you just want to keep your feet warm. So, I just thought it was cute. Um, this was on clearance, and this was L Decor, and this was $3.99. Alright, so then this next rug, y'all, okay, first of all, just look at, look at how beautiful this is. It's so cute. I actually saw this rug on Overstock and had it in my cart, was going to get it. However, I went into Burlington and saw it on the display underneath something and it had a clearance tag on it. So I ended up getting this for $3.99. Winning! <laughs> so I'm thinking that this one is going to go in the kitchen somewhere. But yeah, I thought this was super cute. 
my next phase of getting home decor stuff is going to be like a gold and white so everything i get from here on out is going to be more like gold and white but anyway um i got this thing right here really don't know what this is <laughs> to be honest but it was at that like yard sale thing and i was like well i could put towels here or you know i can put like envelopes i don't know like i just thought it'd be i could be creative with it i could figure out where to put it maybe make it a decoration piece or make it a storage piece i don't know but um yeah i just picked it up because i just felt like i'll find something to do with it <laughs> thing I got was this package from Zazzle. I went on here looking for paper to use. So I don't like that it was supposed to be like gold glitter specs. Like that's the way it was supposed to be. But when I got it, this is how it turned out. So it's like a faded. It's still very nice. It's not what I ordered, not what I, what I was expecting, but it's still really nice. So what I'm thinking is actually going in and hand painting the glitter on here the way I want to to make this look the way I want it to look so yeah I don't know guys you guys let me know what y'all think um should I just keep looking or do y'all like this and this is for the mini bar area so yeah it's just this dark but it fades so it's like it's beautiful but then it's like well Jacob Okay, okay, he want to watch that, Noah. Let him watch that. It's like it's beautiful. It fades. It's like an ombre type thing. And then it's like, mm, I wanted it to be gold. So, I don't know. Um, they did refund me for this one. And I think I'm going to give Zazzo another try. Because, I mean, they made this when I ordered it. So, it's not like... You know, and I could have customized it too. They sent me a message and said, you know, basically, like if you want to put another order in and customize, y'all look at that. Tell me my picture's not about to be bomb. <laughs> so, as y'all can see, I am more like a dark color type girl. You know, I like all the dark colors, the prints. This is so great, gaspy to me. And that's what I'm going for. So, yeah. I just love this right here. This whole little look. I may start taking my little pictures on here <laughs> anyway so yeah that's that and then i have one more thing to show y'all i don't know anything about trying to find a round rug it is so hard at the right price but anyway i found this and it is so soft like super soft it's really pretty i want this to go underneath the table in the dining room area in the dining area so yeah i was happy to find this at this size they had like a ton of them but this one was just i was just like i cannot walk away from this this is the perfect color it is soft it's really nice it's not a cheap rug so yeah i love this and it's gonna go underneath the table so perfect with my um with these chairs right here so that looks right there that gray and blue so nice so yeah, I like the way that looks. Same brand for all the rugs. So yeah, you can find this one on Overstock, I think. If I can find any of this stuff, I know I won't be able to find those vases because you know, of course I'm sure that came out, came out of some 90 year old house. But um, if I can find it, um, any of these, I will link them down in the description bar. All right, guys so that is it um i'm not gonna do a whole lot today today it's gonna be like real chill um it's sunday so i need to get ready for the week no i have school tomorrow um back to normal schedule after the weekend so i'm just gonna be like cleaning and straightening i and we haven't left leftovers for lunch today there is a few other things i need to show you guys some diy stuff and then one large item that sorry i can't bring in the house but I'll show you guys um, later in the week and then um, I'll show you guys probably oh I'll show you the foyer and give you like my ideas and stuff on what I have planned for that area and then the plans for everything else in the house so we'll do that um, sometime later in the week we'll talk about all of that but yeah I enjoy hanging out with you guys hope you guys enjoyed it um, that's it y'all I love you guys thank you so much for watching we'll see you in the next one Just call